Hi, my name is Sarah Spencer and I'm a hobbyist maker. I come from so many different angles um, and I approach my work in so many different ways. Um, I come from the technology side of things, I come from the artistic creative side of things, um, I do do the drawing of, of the um, of the artworks before I get into the wool and work. So I, I can't really pin myself down. I'm I just play around with all the variables um, and come up with something new and distinctive. Uh, the last project was for the Geelong Scarf um, Festival. So for that, I took a photo of um, of our own local girls, the girls in the Lucky Way. And I converted that into a three color pattern for a oversized scarf. Um, so the method that I used for that it was is brand new. I had to rewrite my algorithms um, for converting patterns into the knitting machine format. Um, it took quite a long time, but I'm really proud of that work. I have to say it's the yarn. It's the yarn I work with because it is such a, a, a fuzzy. Um, malleable material that um, I can if, if I make something that's supposed to fit like a if I make it like a for example a laptop cover um, I don't have to get the size perfect because it stretches and it forms and it molds around things um, and if I don't like what I've done I can just unravel and start again and I haven't lost any material it's just yarn is a really nice material to work with Favourite project would have to be my um, son's baby blanket. So I knitted that one um, when he was two weeks old. Um, and it's a full size baby blanket. It, and um, it's the cover, it's designed to look like the cover of a book. And the title of the book is um, This Is How It All Began by my son. Ooh, what would I like to learn? Um, there's a lot of things. Um, but at the moment, what I would really love to be able to do um, is um, take my knitting machine and attach it to a second knitting machine um, so that I can create true double-sided knitting. Um, and in order to do that, I'm going to need to learn um, how to uh, combine the two knitting machines together and modify um, the connecting arms so that they will knit simultaneously side by side. 